he basically like that. That was like his last remaining match. Go to the Green Sluster, just let the gear place out. Go to the Green Sluster, just let the gear place out. Oh, that's awesome. I didn't think I was that close. Despite their transgressions against the Covenant, they are still of sentinel blood. What you interfere with now is bigger than you can imagine. Secret encounters are optional. Timed encounters hidden in the world. Any resources spent in a secret encounter will not be restored afterwards. If you run out of time and fail, you can retry the secret encounter. Awards one weapon point. Okay. Deals damn bonus damage to energy shields, maximize damage potential by using at medium to close range.
is that like music? Oh, it is an album. <laughs> Mech, can clear a path forward. The map does not reveal secrets. That much I
Okay, let's also see this. So I've got everything but four things now. I missed one at the start at the least, so three things more. Like if you're coming from the air, looking down at their feet, looking straight at them and really close, or kind of a little bit farther away, I think there's like different kill, glory kills. Okay, so this is the fight area, that's right. Okay, um, Obviously, it's not a big enough, he died. Looks like they keep trading, right? It's like maybe they killed like a million and there's still a million left. Maybe it was just so like, maybe it was just like numbers, right? It's like they were outnumbered by so much that they didn't have enough of these power cells to keep winning. Maybe that's it. And so they just kept barely losing. Okay, I may have needed the third, third one. I didn't mean to hit it twice there. I don't know if I would have for sure. It was close. <laughs> Weapon points and an Empyrean key. Each Slayer gate is unlocked with a Slayer key, which is near the gate. Interesting. There's a Slayer key, okay. So...
You have been acquired an Empyrean key. Quell acquire all six Empyrean keys to activate the Maker device in the Fortress of Doom, which unlocks the Unmaker. Okay. Look at me in all my glory. I told you all to leave me here. Betrayer. I am where I belong. You want to play Quidditch? I used to love that so much. Saving your people will not bring you peace. Only make the burden you carry hey, worse. I, I caught the Quidditch, so I win. I saved my people. I don't know what you just did, but that's cool. And now you seek to defy the con maker herself. It is your people's time now to give penance. Just as it was mine. You're the betrayer, so I don't know if I should... Hear me, Slayer. When his heart is laid to rest, then his soul will be at peace. When and so will mine. Betrayer. After years of prolonged war against the demonic threat invading their world, Argent Denor launched an offensive strike across dimensions, sending their greatest warriors into the heart of hell itself. Despite their training and their preparedness, their honor was undone by bas basit, oh my gosh, by deceit. Betrayal at the highest levels of command left Argent Denor's bravest warriors cut off and scattered in the hellscape. But of these last remaining night sentinels, only one remained in hell by choice. Betrayer of the Argenta, it was Commander Valen who relinquished the keys to the elemental sepulchre in return for his son's resurrection. Haunted by demonic visions, the image of his son's tortured existence plagued him without relent. The whispers of demons pushed him towards madness. In a moment of weakness, he fell prey to the demon's trickery, sealing the fate of Argent Denor and dooming the kingdom, to which he swore a lifelong oath to protect. Valen chose exile in the hellscape for his sacrilege.
Okay, so my game crashed and my OBS. So hopefully I don't have to redo all of that. Hopefully. If I do, that's really gonna suck. Hopefully it's kind of like a, a small save. Oh, thank you. Have it! Yes! <laughs> I was so afraid. I was like, I don't, I really don't want to do this again. <laughs> Corruption cleansed. <laughs> Got them all. So I know I missed. Uh, extra life at the start, but I mean, it's whatever, right? It's kind of whatever. Wait, are you saying I didn't gain any, like, XP? What do you mean I didn't gain any XP? Or did it, like, give it to me already, and since I hit continue now, I'm just like, I don't know. Whatever. I'm just super glad it saved my progress and I didn't get, like, reset and have to do that whole level again. That would <laughs> Sucked. Okay. So I think um, one of my friends said that he played this game and it was like maybe 12 hours for him. I'm kind of doing like a completionist route. I don't know if he did or not. You can now find the so. remaining hell priests by activating your celestial locator. Not only that, he did it on like the easiest level, I think is what he said. Or second easiest or something like that. The I second hell the priest easiest, is located in the northern region of Earth. I will calibrate the portal now. Is understandable because like, you know. The hub has several areas locked off due to power constraints. Once power has been restored, you will be able to access the entire ship. Okay. Which is understandable because sometimes you just want to play the game and get the story, right? You don't want to necessarily be stuck in battles because they take so long. 